when we were doing auditions, we saw a lot of actors for this role, and they'd come in, and they just didn't seem to understand the rhythm or the, the thought process, the sort of pinball logic of my brain. And I was beginning to really think that the play was lousy until Alex walked in the door, and suddenly it came to life, and it was like watching my mini-me. When I saw the script for the first time, it rolled right off my tongue, and it felt exactly how I would say these things, um, as if he's been reading my diary. He's so much fun to watch, and, and working with Mark is so much fun to do that there's a lot of laughter. We are laughing quite a bit. It's a chance to see an actor do what an actor does best in creating theater magic. Because an actor's dream is to play new characters and to create, uh, it, in, in this show especially, 20 different personalities. I would be very excited to see somebody take on that challenge. And to let you all know, I'm totally up for it. It lets us look at this story in a way that's not specifically about a kid going away to college. It is very much about a kid becoming an adult. It really speaks to that sort of effervescent anxiety that happens when you're about to launch into college. Seeing something new, something that has never been seen before, um, is always just exciting. Is it gonna be great? Is it gonna be better than great? This is such a great play for The Hub because our mission about common humanity, for me, really resounds when we do pieces about what connects us, what binds us. The Hub and I are a really good match in that regard. They did the world premiere of my play, Birds of a Feather, which then won the Helen Hayes Award for Best New Play. And I find that when we, f we locate stories that are told in a really magical way, audiences will walk away from The Hub feeling that connective tissue between us. Doing a one-person show on the outset could feel very lonely, and everyone here at The Hub, Helen, Mark, and everybody else involved, has been so welcoming and embracing, and I don't feel alone, even though my cast party will be very small. Come see the world premiere of How I Paid for College at The Hub Theater December 7th through December 30th.